fellow students let us apply switch statement to perform algebraic operations basically in simple algebraic operations you can display all the contents simultaneously whether it is addition subtraction multiplication or division in switch statement you can display according to your choice let us start with the program so that you can understand the content clearly the number of variables required int suppose i enter only two values print f enter first number you can declare the values as float because in case of division decimal answers are required scan f percent is d ampersand a it's the entry of uh, first value similarly you can enter the second value second number here you can write b the second number is b print f enter or you can write uh, index like this you can design then print f number 1 addition then copy and paste four conditions are required number 2 for subtraction or you can write subtraction then number 3 for product and number 4 for division print f enter your choice for choice let us declare one integer value and because in switch you have to pass the integer value scan f percent is d ampersand n now inside switch pass n now different cases are required for first case you have to apply the addition print f answer after adding 
the numbers is equal to percentage 0.2f up to two point of decimal if you want to display now you can write here a plus b and you have to apply break now for second case you can copy paste the content answer after subtracting the numbers here you can write minus and case number three answer after multiplying the numbers and you can write here a multiply b Basically, I am controlling the content by using switch statement. You can display according to your choice. Then after dividing the numbers, you can write here A divided by B. Then default statement can write printf please enter the correct choice then break it is the program to operate arithmetic operations using switch statement let us execute the program enter first number 3 and 4 and x now enter your choice suppose i enter 1 answer after adding the numbers it's 0, 0.00 let us check the program again And write here sum is equal to a plus b suppose i write here sum declaration of sum is required here let us execute the program now Execute the program, compile and run. Suppose I enter first value as 3, suppose I enter 1. After adding the numbers is 0, 0.00. Let us check the output. Percentage F is required here basically. These are the wrong entries. And write here A plus B. Now execute the program. That first value is 3 and second is 15. Suppose I enter 3, the product is 45. Now it's okay. In the previous case, one mistake is there. Basically, control string is percentage D. I write here percentage D and the declared content is in float. I have to write percentage F here. It was the error. Errors are basically the learning paths. You can learn the content. Suppose first value is 11 and second is 12. I enter the choice 4. 11 divided by 12, it's 0 0.92.
suppose I enter the wrong choice 3 and 4 suppose I enter here 7 please enter the correct choice again one more problem which can be there suppose first value is 3 and second is 0 I enter the fourth choice hash j means number is not divisible basically this content is not calculated you can control this content also inside the case you can write here if b is equal to 0 print f the reason is not possible else you can copy paste this content you can perform basically division if the second value after division you can write here the white sign let us execute the program now first number is 3 second is 0 suppose I enter the fourth choice division is not possible now the program is up to the mark after removing various errors you can execute the program clearly I repeat again to perform algebraic operation using the switch statement you can write your index and you can enter the choice and choice should be in the form of integer then as per your requirement you can develop the cases first case is for addition and second is for subtraction then multiplication and fourth case is for division and inside the fourth case I apply if else statement also and last one is default case if the user enter the values other than 1 2 3 4 hope you understand the content of a switch statement these are basically the two programs this one is the previous program just a displaying of the day of the week and this one is today's program with the help of this program basically I control addition subtraction multiplication and division according to the choice of user thanks for watching my video